here at NC State, uh, I'm really fortunate that I'm able to teach a variety of classes, both in the Department of Communication, also in the Department of Public Administration. I mostly focus on undergraduate courses uh, at the junior, senior level, so public relations, strategy, public relations campaigns, uh, as well as teaching some graduate level courses uh, that reach over into other aspects of CHAS. So a lot of the research that I'm doing is really helping to fuel some of that material that I see being a void in our scholarship and our understanding of how organizations are using Facebook, using MySpace, YouTube, Twitter. Uh, so a lot of things go to look at applying those uh, basic public relations theoretical principles you know, not only of relationship management, but strategic communication, you know, tapping into uh, dimensions of interactivity on the web to see how truly uh, meaningful these organizations are using social media. So a lot of the stuff that I've done with Disney, you know, continued since uh, that time. I've, be, I've been brought in on several different special projects that they have going on. You know, typically, I'll go down in the summer, do some consulting work, uh, you know, working with their government relations office, their media relations, you know, whatever the dimension of public relations is that they have projects coming up on. And, and so I've really been able to see a lot of different sides to Walt Disney World that I never would have been exposed to. Uh, I had an opportunity to move out to San Francisco and work for a public relations agency. And one of the first accounts that they said uh, I had the opportunity to work on was promoting the Harry Potter movie franchise. To help promote the first couple of movies, I uh, wound up being involved with um, doing some media tours uh, for Daniel Radcliffe and some of the other actors, you know, placing them on the Leno Show, Good Morning America, CNN. So the things that I'm teaching in the classroom now really are things that um, I may not have had the opportunity to work with in the, uh, while I was out in the field doing the work, but through my consulting that I do, through my research that I've done, I'm able to stay on top of these latest trends, bring those into the classroom so that you know, students aren't relying on outdated textbooks or experience that I had 10 years ago in the profession that really are outdated at this point. One of the nice things about being here in the Triangle is that my students have access to many different types of organizations, government industry, nonprofit organizations, for-profit companies, and they're all actively pursuing internships and jobs with these organizations. So I consider myself really learning as much from them about what's going on in the field, what's going on in industry, that they're bringing back to classroom discussions and, and contributing to that learning environment of everyone around us that I, I many times think they're giving me as much of an education as I am giving to them when I'm lecturing from the book, lecturing about my own research and practical experience. One of the things that I've found particularly impressive with Chaz and it, is just the sense of camaraderie that I see among various faculty here within, not only within the department, but also within the entire college. You know, I have uh, research collaborators across disciplines you know, we regularly get together, discuss what we have going on with our own research and how we can really help one another out. At other institutions I've seen, you know, it's one of those where you come into the office, you close your door, you do your work, and then you're done. But here it's a much different environment. I see myself staying here, you know, staying here at NC State, really exploring uh, everything that academics has to offer. Because not only does it make me, does it, does it quench my desire to answer those why questions, but it also really helps keep me energized, being, by, being surrounded by students who are, who are excited to be here, really eager to learn different aspects of public relations and communication as well.